So we're embarking on a journey to our top secret storage location. Um, Sean has informed me that one of our Facebook fans has inquired about our Bernoulli ball exhibit. So we're going to see. Hey, Rosie. <laughs> we're going to see if we can uncover it. All right, stay tuned. So we've arrived at our secret storage location and um, we're about to see if we can uncover the Bernoulli ball exhibit. It's here somewhere. It's our creator. creator. It's our creator. creator. Yep. Aha! Uh -huh. There it is. So there it is. Covered in dust. The boot is gone. Needs a little TLC, but uh, I think maybe we can bring this back to life. So, <laughs> complete with beach balls. <laughs> Alright, so there it is. So, here we are back at Flandreau, and uh, Rosie's capable hands have already gotten the, the bulk of the, the gunk off of the Bernoulli ball here, so uh, it's on its way. Uh, before you know it, we'll be back on the floor. Okay. So that is part one. That's the Bernoulli ball. Yep. Now we're gonna see. I never recall the bearings are pretty bad at that, but we'll soon, soon see. What we're so we're gonna find out. Now, when when was the last time the Bernoulli ball exhibit was fired up, Neil? 2005. Uh, do you remember it, Neil? So it's been about five years since this thing was on? Yeah. Okay, we're about to find out if the Bernoulli ball exhibit still works. And hopefully not get a whole bunch of stuff spewed at us. And it, or get electrocuted. Sounds like it's working. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. That is awesome. That thing hasn't been turned on in five years. Is that it? Wait. Look at this. The Bernoulli ball exhibit lives. <laughs> to return to Flandreau. All right, science fans. Bernoulli ball's coming back. <laughs> <laughs>